we're back. We're back with Everything's Funny at 3 a.m. This is Dub, and we're still playing the Cat Lady. We're at part 13. Last episode was uh, was rough, man. I mean, we lost our new buddy. We we lost Liz. Liz jumped off a fucking building. She's dead. You know, Susan was dead too, but she's back. You know, so I, I'm sure we'll see Liz again. She said she's gonna come back and help us out. I'm sure we'll see her. Still sad to see her go. You know, just real talk here for a minute. We're just gonna take a minute to talk about the fucked up shit that happened last episode. And then, you know, it's. <laughs> Dr. X, you know, I thought, I thought, you know, he would just try to put the moves on Susan. That, uh, he would, he would, you know, try to, uh, force her into some, some sexual relations in his office. But no, it turns out he was a murderer. And guess what? He, uh, he stabbed Susan to death. But you know what? You know, as sad as all this is, and as depressing as it is, guess what? Yep, that's right. Motherfucking wizards never die. And, uh, apparently, Susan's a fucking wizard now. Because she's immortal. So, I think we should keep moving ahead and trudge forward. Let's do this. That stupid crow from earlier wouldn't shut up. Okay, we pulled it. Let's pull it again. Eh, okay, well, we'll just do uh, nothing. There's an eyeball in the mirror. Okay, I have to say this. Oh, God. Who, who this sounds like something from Killer 7. doors. I can't see them. Just walk back to the right side of the stage. I feel it is Susan Cannon, Mister. All right. Wait. Okay, here we go. Oh, what the fuck are those things? Does Susan like my girls? I knew she would. They're very pretty young ladies. Yeah. Whatever they are, tell them to stop staring. <laughs> but they are here to guide, Susan. They are the guardians of the doors. They know which door she should enter to get the rewards. But there is one problem. Whoa. But there is one problem. problem. I'm not even surprised. Which door should I go through? I will leave that to Susan's own best judgment. I want to get revenge. Oh no, one of these. I'm not good at these. Okay. And I'm guessing you can't tell me which is which. It's something I've forgotten myself a long time ago, Susan. Well, does it really matter? What I'm questioning is also the leads to find the right door. Hmm. Okay, I might remember this. Ugh, I, I remember, I mean, everybody's done this riddle before, but I can't remember it. Uh, let me poke him. I'm gonna poke you. 
That'll teach you to stop staring, you horrible, ugly doll. Ha! <laughs> okay, let's ask a question. Which door? If I enter the left door, will I go? Which door would you enter to get the reward? Which door should I not enter? Ugh. I know people I know are gonna be like, dude, how do you not know this? Wait, I wanna talk to... No, I don't wanna open it. I don't wanna open it not yet. How do I talk to this one? I thought I just need to ask them both questions. Oh jeez, 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 jeez. I only get the one question? That's the door I don't go in. Oh god, dude, I'm screwed, aren't I? I, I didn't realize I only had the one question. Duh, that's what he said. Fuck it, dude. Let's just go. Oh, shit. I'm back to the candles, man. Do I have to blow out another one? Shit. I have to blow out another one. We gotta do it all over again. Alright. Let's, um... Here, we'll blow this one out. Let's do it. Okay, so an old lady, or an old man, old lady, he's gonna die. They were already dying, so that's good at least, right? Ugh. Okay. Just die already. Okay. This one I don't feel bad about. I mean, look at the state of them, you know? <laughs> oh shit, look! That was the same room I was in! Oh, that's creepy. It looks like the same room I was in. And it's 10.08. Look at the clock, it's 10.08 like it was. Yeah, it's creepy. Set sound. That squishing sound. Did I choose the wrong door? <laughs> I'll never know. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, it's a body bag. Okay, examine. Yeah, let's open it. Fuck it. Is it me? Okay. Open. Let's do it. Is it gonna be a jump scare? I swear to god. Okay, there we go. Don't get off close to it. Yeah, yeah, it's me again. It's us, Susan! Oh. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> I think I might have chose the wrong door, people. You treacherous, dirty bastard. I opened my heart to you, and you stabbed me to death in cold blood. Oh. You pay for this. I swear you will. Oh, shit. But this means the old woman was right. I can't die. 
I'm immortal. Dude. I think it's time to find out how very mortal you are. Fuck yeah, dude. We're gonna get Dr. X. Hold on. We'll grab. I want to see if I can grab this knife or iron bar. Alright. We're gonna take that shit. Rip it out of that girl's bare chest. Which, that's disturbing. <laughs> Alright. Alright, we already came out of the body bag. We don't need that. Suicide note. Examine. It's the suicide note I wrote. Why would he put it up on the wall? So this is his little place to store bodies, that sick fuck. Alright. I don't need it. Yeah, it's like his trophy room. Another unlucky victim of the killer. This one looks like she's been dead for a long time. I didn't, uh... See if I can examine this body. No, I can't. Okay. Alright, I know we're excited. I know we're gonna go get Dr. X. This is what we've been dreaming of. This is what we want. We want to avenge our own death. And in a way, we want to avenge Liz. I don't. I have a feeling like he. it wasn't his fault that she jumped. But I still am mad about that. So I'm gonna kill him. And just blame him. It, it, he's, a, he's a piece of shit. So let's just do it. Alright, we'll do that next time. On Everything's Funny at 3am. We'll see you then.